This video will list the top five mounted PvP generals available to free-to-play players as of February 2023. As this is the free-to-play list, it will only include generals that are accessible to players regardless of spending. The Amazon App Store now has a landing campaign page that details all the information needed for purchasing through their store. Clicking this link will take you to a page with download instructions and also direct links to the coins that can be purchased for a discount. Clicking these links to check out the discounts or using these links to go directly to your purchase helps support the channel directly, so I greatly appreciate you taking the time to do so. Now back to the top 5 free to play PvP mounted general list. The considerations made for the selection of these generals are mounted attack, mounted defense, mounted HP, march size, and in some cases unique attributes such as debuffs are also considered. Since the video is focused on the usage of these generals as the primary, it will consider general ascension and specialty. Number 5. Yue Fei Yue Fei appears on both the ground and mounted free to play top 5 lists. It's a shame he split between the two troop types. If he were more focused in his troop buffs, he might have made it to the top 5 overall. He's slightly stronger with cavalry than ground. Phase skill increases mounted attack by 25% and mounted HP by 10%. This skill is active both offensively and defensively. Faye places 17th in attack, 19th in defense, and 14th in HP. Not very impressive overall, and there are far better options in the tavern to pick from. Yue Fei is available in the tavern. Number 4. Barbarossa Barbarossa's skill increases march size by 10% and mounted attack by 15%, but the skill is only active offensively. Barbarossa places 18th in attack, 8th in defense, and 4th in HP. His defensive stats are significantly higher than Yue Fei, but he has slightly less attack and a smaller march size when fully maximized. One of the weird nuances of this general is that you can apply a march size rank 4 book to him, but not 1 through 3. This makes the process of adding skill books to him a bit more costly than the others. Barbarossa is available in the tavern. Number 3. Hannibal Hannibal's skill increases mounted attack by a total of 35%, this skill is only fully active when used offensively. Hannibal ranks 5th in attack, 16th in defense, and 2nd in HP. Hannibal's overall buffs as a free-to-play general are exceptionally good. On the downside, his march size increase is much smaller than other generals. Fully maximized Hannibal has a 12% increase to march size, whereas other top generals have around 28%. Hannibal is available in the tavern. Number 2. Martinez Martinez is a fantastic attacking general. His attack buffs are unquestionably high, but his mounted HP and defense are noticeably weaker. Martinez's skill increases mounted attack by 40% when a dragon is equipped. This skill is active both offensively and defensively. Martinez places 3rd in attack, 24th in defense, and 8th in HP. Martinez is a very strong general if you value attack over defensive buffs, but he does require a dragon to be fully effective. In addition to this, Martinez cannot use an attack skill book due to the nature of his primary skill, and like Hannibal, his march size is only 12% when fully maximized. Martinez is available in the tavern. Number 1. Roland Roland's skill increases mounted attack by 30% and mounted HP and defense by 15%. This skill is only active offensively. Roland was out of the spotlight before Ascension, but he's back. Roland received a lot of love with his ascension buffs, so he's a worthwhile choice for a free-to-play primary general. Fully maximized, Roland places 8th in attack, 2nd in defense, and 11th in HP. In comparison to Hannibal and Martinez, Roland has excellent overall buffs, an above-average march size increase of 28%, and additional debuffs to enemy ranged attack. He does not require a dragon as Martinez does, but like Hannibal, he is only fully effective when used to attack. Roland is available in the tavern. Thank you so much for watching this video and supporting the channel. If you liked what you saw, please consider hitting the like button and checking out other videos on the Miser's Guide to Ebony. I'll see you in the next video.